Hi everyone. This video lecture is designed to help students of Cambridge IGCSE Chemistry 0620 for paper 5 practical test or paper 6 alternative to practical. All candidates take one practical paper from a choice of two. In previous lesson, we have done with burette, volumetric pipette and indicators. We have done with indicators like phenolphthalein, and litmus. Phenolphthalein was colorless in acid. It was colorless in acidic solutions and pink in basic solutions. Pink in alkali or base. Pink in base. Phenolphthalein is used with strong base like NaOH. It is used with strong base like NaOH because it gives color change at higher pH. It gives color change at higher pH. Higher pH. Now we will see how methyl orange gives color change. Methyl orange. Methyl orange is a pH indicator frequently used in titration because it gives distinct color at different pH levels. Similarly, as phenolphthalein gives different color with different pH values, methyl orange also gives different colors at different pH values. It gives red color in acidic medium and yellow color in basic medium. See, this is methyl orange. It gives red color in acidic medium and yellow color in basic medium. So it means it is acid and it is base because it turns red after adding methyl orange and it turns yellow after adding methyl orange. So it is base and it is acid. We can learn it with the help of mnemonic like my apple is red. My apple is red and banana is yellow. M for methyl orange. A for acid. Red is red. So it means methyl orange gives red color in acid and B for B for base and methyl orange gives yellow color in base. We can help the pH paper to identify whether a substance is acidic or basic, right? So this is the pH scale. See, the smaller the number on the pH scale, the more acidic the solution. Similarly, the larger the number on the pH scale, the more alkaline the solution. On this scale, we can see acidic solution has a pH number less than seven. If the number is less than seven, it means solution is acidic. If the number is more than seven, it means solution is basic. A neutral solution has a pH number exactly seven. We will use universal indi indicator paper to identify whether a substance is acidic or basic. See, this is the universal indicator paper. We see here dark red color, light, lighter red color orange color, or here we can observe dark blue color. So dark red color indicates highly acidic substance and dark blue, dark blue color on the pH paper will indicate highly basic substance. 
This is if we will test the lemon juice or dilute hydrochloric acid, we will get dark red color. For orange juice, it will be like orangish color because it is slightly acidic. For milk, water, salt, we can get greenish or bluish color, right? Similarly, for oven cleaner or dilute sodium hydroxide, we can get blue color because these are basic solutions. We can have universal indicator in solution showing the color change. Universal indicator may be in the form of solution and it will also show color change. So we have done with indicators. In next part, we will study how to identify the endpoint of a titration using an indicator. Thank you.